I'm Tracy Gore, I'm the currently director of Steve Beagle Housing Association, but I've been appointed as the new chair of the Race Equality Task Force that Mayor Joe Anderson has set up. Well, it's a task force basically to look at race inequality across the city, so it's not just around looking about in, in the city council and the way city council works, it's around every aspect of our society, our city life. Um, so that could be around the police and the criminal justice system, it can be around health and the way uh, people access health, it can be, it's absolutely around education um, and the um, experiences of our young people from early years right through to uh, go to uh, higher and further education. On the one hand, you know, we have the far right wanting to come into our city to march and absolutely, you know, our city saying no, you're, you're not coming here, We're, that's not us, that's not our city. But racism, unfortunately, is quite uh, entrenched in our city, it's institutionalised and so when we look at all the um, all the stats, all the statistics that say when you look at education our kids are um, more likely to um, to be failing in school, they're more likely to be uh, excluded from school and permanently excluded. All the health detriments, and we're looking at COVID-19 now, um, really big impacts on the uh, BME, black and ethnic minority communities. Um, everything that we look at, criminal justice system, uh, over-represented in jail, uh, more likely to be stopped and search. When you go to a jury system, there's no people on our jury, you know, very few uh, black or ethnic minorities that will sit on a jury system, uh, very few through through the judiciary itself. Uh, so every aspect of our city, there's been barriers and there's been historical discrimination that's occurred. And that's why this task force needs to look at not just nice new programs and projects, it needs to get at the root causes um, and how we can start to break down those barriers and to kind of lift everybody up so those people who are behind let's bring them up so that we all move forward together so this is not about you know black people first and you know when we, we you know it's about actually leveling the playing field bringing everyone up so we can all move forward together